For quite some time now, scientists have known that birds are the only living members of the dinosaur family. We know that birds evolved from non-avian dinosaurs around 160 million years ago during the Jurassic period, and we also know that a lot of dinosaurs back then probably displayed behavior similar to what birds did and still do today. And that was thrown into sharp focus a couple of years ago with the discovery of the best preserved dinosaur embryo that we've ever found. Welcome back to Paleopedia and birds lay eggs. That's a fact I'm sure most of you can agree upon and birds when they're in the egg do a very unique behavior towards the end of their gestation period. This behavior, which is known as tucking, is unique to birds. Only birds do this. The embryo will curve its back along the inner shell wall and tuck its head to its chest, almost underneath its wings. This behavior is believed to provide leverage to assist the chick in hatching out of its shell. And up until 2021, it was believed that only birds utilize this tucking behavior until a dinosaur embryo was unearthed. Now the fossil itself was actually discovered back in the year 2000. They cataloged it and put it in storage. They didn't think there was anything spectacular to it. It wasn't until the late 2010s, after the construction of the Yingliang Stone Natural History Museum in China, that researchers moving the fossils from storage to the museum took a closer look. And it is a good thing that they did because inside this egg, they found the most well-preserved fossilized embryo ever found. It is a remarkable find because not only is this an incredibly well-preserved fossil, it's in late stage gestation, which means the animal is basically fully developed and just waiting to hatch, and it is positioned in that tucking posture, just like birds still do today. The baby dinosaur inside is a theropod. Specifically, it is an oviraptorosaur, which is a group of dinosaurs closely related to birds. The fossil itself is between 66 and 72 million years old, so it doesn't give a whole lot of insight into when exactly this behavior in theropod dinosaurs, including birds, evolved, but it does show that this tucking behavior wasn't unique to just birds. The study does note, however, that because this is the only known specimen of its kind, it's difficult to draw any distinct conclusions regarding it. It's entirely possible that this might just be a unique fossil in and of itself. This might have not been the norm for dinosaur embryos as they were preparing to hatch, but I think this is a very good indicator that that is what's going on. Personally, I'm of the idea that this represents that this tucking behavior wasn't unique to just birds and was representative of a larger group of animals, especially since oviraptorosaurs are closely related to birds. And it does give us a little bit more insight into the evolutionary history of certain behaviors. With how rare fossilization actually happens, despite the numerous fossils that we have, this is a remarkable find that gives us a lot of insight into the evolutionary links between birds and dinosaurs. 